Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we got the Aru three. I said a two, three suggestions, but don't mind that. We got two, count them, two suggestions for this blazing video. But before we get into today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe to join the Blazer Army. Or Blazer, we're not an army. Blazer fam, Blazer fam. <laughs> Okay, so the first suggestion from Quan Double. Can you make an entire habitable solar system with Stephenson 218 as the star? I certainly can. Okay, so we're going to grab our old friend, Stephenson, and we're going to do the habitable zone. And think a seven-planet system. Whoa, where's the actual? Whoa. Okay, so it's right there. Can you guys keep track of that? I, guys, I really need your help here. Okay. Ah! Stop moving! Doot, 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 and doot, and... I was supposed to put seven down, but I think I put more than seven. It doesn't matter! Um, hello. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. You know what, you know what, you know what? Blazers, I think we can make two suggestions out of this, what, this first suggestion. Okay, um, just, just trust the process. So, our, we need a planet for this. Our next suggestion is play Undertale. Um, I'm sorry, but I'm not familiar with Undertale, so I googled it. It looks a bit dark, so instead of making a planet of him, I'm going to make a planet with a happy face. Because that's the best kind of planet. Thank you, unknown bra three. I mean, so, sorry, six zero nine nine. Here we. What in the world is that? Woof. Have the. What? Uh, that ain't good. That ain't good, chat. Oh my god, what is? What is this? Wait, where did everything go? It just disappeared out of existence. All I tried to do was make a spot. My sm <laughs> All I tried to do was make a smiley face on a planet. Come on, and let's just put it. Just put them right here. Actually, boop, 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 boop. There we go. And let's go to our old friend. Uh, I don't know what the name is. Okay. Here we go. Smiley face. It's always good when you're smiling. Oh, wah, oh, boom. There we go. And this is Bobby Bobberson. Yes, guys, remember that name. Bobby Bobberson. How do you spell it? I don't know. Okay, there's Bobby Bobberson, the smiley face. With some added eyebrows. Okay. <laughs> Oh my god, oh no! Bobby Bobberson! <laughs> oh my god, I'm just laughing at the name, Bobby Bobberson. Oh my god. Okay, move. <laughs> moving on. Of course, since these suggestions were short. Guys, on this Universe Inbox video, I'm gonna need tons of suggestions. Tons and tons. I'm talking about... Okay, I'll stop. So, what I'm going to do... Is, is, it, I'm going to make two asteroids binary with each other. They're orbits. Yeah, it's kind of binary. Wow. Uh, why is this thing not selecting both? Yes, create berry center. Hey. So it's kind of like this thing is orbiting the berry center because of the tug, the tidal pulling. Is that a thing? The gravity inflict on this object. Yeah, I really don't know what I'm talking about. Okay. But wait, what happened? Uh, okay, that was that that was all part of the show, people. Okay, then we're going to make a, another star. Slow down time. Can it orbit? It can orbit. Orbit? Uh, not so much. How much mass does this thing have? Wow. Okay. How about 0 0.7? That's a less binary, right? Create a berry center. Speed up time. And you'll watch if we focus on the berry center. It also, look, again, it looks like this thing is... Oh, the, th like this thing is orbiting. <gasps> Whoa, as it gets farther out, this also gets farther out. 
from the Barry Center. And then as it gets closer, it also gets closer. Wow, that is scientific. Amazing. I give that a blazer approval of nine. What is a blazer approval, you might ask? Well, it's the approviest approval. I know that's not even close to a word, but it is today on this channel. If you say that to your parents, they'll be extremely confused. Okay, so we're going to add some planets for this system. Well, I'm going to put planets in this habitable zone. Maybe the bigger star will tug on them and pull them out of orbit. Beep, boop, bubbly, beep, beep. Oh, I don't know why I had them on. We're giving this tons of planets for absolutely no reason. One extremely close and one extremely far. We're going to give it kind of an outer system. These are going to be affected because if I put them like right here, they're not going to orbit them. Okay, whoa, whoa, hold your horses, matey. Okay. Ooh, their orbits are getting, like, very tight right here, then expanding back out over here. That's cool. Oh, I just got an idea. We're going to put a um gas giant here. And it's going to have a lot of mass, so it's going to tug on these things and mess up their orbits. Why am I doing this, if you ask me that? I, I would reply with, I don't know. I honestly don't. Okay, is that doing anything? Nope, it needs more gravity. Okay. Okay. Does that do anything? Ooh, it looks like it does. It looks like it does. Okay, let's look for some habitable planets. A lot of them don't have water, aka probably aren't habitable, aka... They don't have life, aka little Jamie's not there, aka okay, I'll, st AKA I'll stop now. Okay, ooh, 90 Celsius, that is on fire. Oh, wow, smoking. Okay, so let me turn on city lights and vegetation. Does it even have land? No, no, it doesn't. What do we do to planets without land? If you're a true blazer, you would know on this channel. We throw big things straight into it to probably annihilate it but does that matter absolutely not okay kaboom kablowy kapow it's the small bang this is the <laughs> this is the small bang the little the big bang's child the small bang okay continuing on tidally locked now it's tidally locked with um the star one Celsius once again. Oh, that, yay, it's late. It actually worked. I mean, <clears throat> of course it worked. What do you mean? Of course it worked. It always works. Now burn this thing to the ground. <laughs> I don't know what kind of laugh that was. But, yeah. That was a blazer laugh. Okay, woo! Oh, the water's coming back. The water's coming back to town. Yeah. Okay. So let's equalize gas and set liquid. It has a good atmosphere, but yeah. Okay. Let's spiffy this thing up. Let's remove the liquid so we can remove. So so we can reveal. Okay. This is this is too slow. Whoa. Okay. This this just a, whoa. And then throw a. Oh, that looks better. That looks so much better, but with the planet escaping tool, it, oh, it just changed color. Why did it change color? I don't know. I'm going to throw a small asteroid into it. Wait, 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 wait. Um, editor, zoom in. Editor, rewind. <laughs> okay, um, guys, go rewind the video. Look, look, there's vegetation. If you rewind the video, thank you. Oh my gosh, there's vegetation! But only, well, it's like, it hit the thing. What am I gonna do? You are absolutely right. You probably didn't think of what I'm thinking. We're going to surround the planet in asteroids. Eradicate the enemy! Boom, bam, hey! Boom, bam. Did I say I was done? Boom, bam. Hey, boom, bam, let me, let me cook, let me cook, there we go, a bunch of asteroids headed straight into this thing, <laughs> oh, there's some vegetation, yes, 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 those big collisions are what we 
need. Let's throw Phobos into it. Not big enough. Sharon. No, Nay, Naymaki? Tell me in the comment section how to pronounce it, please. Okay, just throw a bunch of these in here. Well, I'm spamming a bunch of whatever these are called, Naymakis or something. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. And also, go subscribe to Space VR. He's a pretty cool dude. And also, if Diego Alexander has a channel, um, when he first, like, subscribed to the channel, I hope he subscribed. If you're not subscribed to Diego Alexander, Alexando, you should subscribe. It's amazing. You get cool perks, even though you won't get, you won't get cool perks. You'll get, <laughs> you'll get three boxes of free merch delivered to your doorstep after, like, three months after subscribing, even though you won't. It's a great deal. I mean, who doesn't want to subscribe? Okay, after... Enough with the advertising. Let's get on with the chaos. Donna, Boom! That was anticlimactic. Okay, hold on. Let me cook. Let me... Lay... 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 I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. You guys can try to pronounce that if you want to. Lay... Lapitus. Lay... Lay... Forget it. Forget it. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not even gonna try. I'm not. I'm not doing. It. <laughs> Throw your Ropa in it. Whoa! <laughs> oh, that hit it with some devastating force. That was a big kaboom. Not the Big Bang. A big kaboom. Oh, I put water there. Oh, remove water. Okay. Remove gas, oxygen, carbon, water, sulfur, argon. Hydrogen, helium, methane, ammonia, and nitrogen. Oh, it seems to be like kind of nitrogen. Now um, we'll do a little bit of equalizing. Oh my gosh, that's way too much. That's way too much, chap. I didn't say chat, I said chap. We're just going to do zero. It's probably going to nap. What? Oh my gosh, what is happening? Clear all fragments. Clear all. Clear. Oh, I was pressing Control D, not Control. Wait, what's the button to make the fragments go away? Uh, uh, wait, does Control A explode? Oh, it targets everything in the solar or in the in the simulation. Okay, let's see the very center of everything. Is probably wait, I completely forgot this is a two-star system. Like I completely. <laughs> forgot about the star over here sorry you were left out little star i'll make it up to you by exploding you and sending your fragments into deep space Dun -dun -dun. Yeah, that's what i'm talking about i'll see you guys in the next episode like and subscribe and don't forget to listen for my epic food of the day eat some some chicken nuggets covered in chocolate. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.